All right. Well, this is it. Final game of the 2018 season for the Westminster Wildcats. Win, lose, or draw, this is it. So you're probably going to see. <laughs> Obviously, uh, they win. There are going to be some smiles, but there are going to be some tears either way. <laughs> Remember, you've got 14 seniors on this team. So a lot of these girls know this is their last game at Westminster, and for a lot, their last game. So there's going to be some emotions run high at the end of the game. All right, so Westminster's taking the field, waiting for Lafayette. So as you look on the field, you can see... Reese Early Wine and Goal on defense, Brittany Johnson, Macy Daniels, Jordan Heuser. Not sure who's it. Also see there Samantha Huber at mid, Whitney Radloff at mid, Jenna Galicados at mid. There you see Deanne File on attack. We also see uh, Haley Counts, Josie, and Danny Mabry. All right, here's Whitney taking the draw. Whitney's been fantastic all year. She's been fantastic on the draw and has been huge for Westminster the entire season. Draw control is critical. Oh, we're gonna do it again. You can see how fast the girls take off as soon as the whistle's blown. This, um, especially with number 18, Laurie Lohman for Lafayette. Now she's been, uh, she has over, I think, over 70 goals this year. So she's been really, really good. There we go. There's the draw control. Nobody's got it yet. So that gets picked up by Samantha Huber. Brought back to the defense. All uh, right, here we go. There it is. You see it moving up the field. Jordan Heuser. Good transition game. And we see it in the middle to Whitney Radloff. Up the field to Danny Mabry. So they're gonna set it up. There's Jenna Galicados with the ball. Back to Whitney at the right side, outside the 12 meter arc. You can see kind of an isolation play forming here. Oh, break it back, a little miscommunication there. Danny Mabry's back to pick it up. Now Jenna with the ball. Back over to Josie in the middle. She goes to the eight meter arc. Back to Jenna Galicados. Now Danny Mabry with the ball. Swings it over to Samantha Huber. Swings back over to Josie. Back to Whitney. Good ball control here by the Cats. Starting out nice and calm, trying to get a good look off a good draw. So switch to the left hand, back to Jenna Galicados. Jenna, oh, with the short stutter step, feed to, oh, good feed to Whitney Radloff in the middle. Good hustle by Dan File back to the Lafayette goal. As you can see, Danny Mabry putting some pressure on the Lafayette goal to, oh, and this is what we're looking for right there. Oh, good pickup by Deanne, and then, oh, Samantha Huber picks up the loose ball. There's a foul, it looks like a, a stick in the sphere. So, so Westminster's gonna get a chance of a good look here. There's a feed over to Danny Mabry. Back over to Deanne File. Deanne's been fantastic behind the net this year. Has over 20 goals, uh, which has been huge. Absolutely huge for Westminster this year. Deanne, swing it back to the side, back to Samantha Huber, over to Danny Mabry. Offside on Westminster. Okay, that's gonna get the ball here with transition opportunity. Do have the player open right there, about the 48. Lafayette set behind the goal. 
Trying to roll. Oh, good double defense by Westminster. Causes a loose ball. Picked up by Brittany Johnson and, and then brought over to the goalie by Macy Daniels. Great defensive play. All right, here's where Reese Early Line's gonna, Early Line's gonna survey the field. She's looking, she finds Whitney Radloff. Oh, on the sideline, that ball is down. Lafayette player still trying to pick it up. This is trouble right here. It's good defense there, picked up by the Wildcats. Again, back to the goalie, Reese Early Line. Westminster has struggled a little bit clearing the ball in the last couple games, but it's getting better. There's goalie Reese Early Line walking the ball up the field. See, there's a lot of action at midfield right now. Players uh, trying to get clear for that, trying to get open for that long clear. Oh, there's a long feed down to Danny Mabry at midfield. What a catch. Good transition to Whitney Radloff down the field. Ball now in the center, Samantha Huber, left-handed shot. Oh. Good transition from right to left hand for the shot, picked up by Dan File behind the goal. Dan File over to Haley Counts, who's been just an absolute monster on that side of the goal this year. Back out top to Samantha Huber at the 12. Strong the uh, defense out. Back to Dan File behind the net. Oh, it's a good pressure by Lafayette. That ball at midfield picked up by a hustling Macy Daniels. Westminster being smart with the ball. Oh, the ball is down here. Struggle. Uh, ball still loose. Picked up again by Westminster and then lost. All right, picked up by Westminster, Jordan Hoiser. This is classic Jordan running down the field. She's done this all year. Just been an absolute horse for Westminster. So strong, so smart, playing fantastic defense. Westminster, a lot of control here early on. Ball, left side of the goal to Haley Counts. Spreading the field here. Jordan back on the straining line. Whitney Radloff comes back up top. Ball now with Samantha Huber. Transition to Whitney Radloff. Now transition to Danny Mabry. Back to Whitney Radloff. Back to Samantha Huber. Swing over to Deanne File, who's up, out, up top. Not, not the typical position for Deanne. She tends to play close to the goal. Deanne File over to Danny Mabry. Back to Samantha Huber. Around the top of the 12. Swung over to Jenna Galicados. Jenna looking for an opening, goes right. Ooh, Deanne File behind the net. There's a potential obstruction developing there for Jenna. Haley counts, swinging around the top of the 12. Good feed in front. Yes, Whitney Radloff with a beautiful goal. Beautiful play by Westminster. That is classic Whitney Radloff. Haley counts. So that's classic Westminster lacrosse all year. Whitney Radloff sneaks into the middle, incredibly patient with the ball, looks at the goal, makes the goalie make the first move, and just buries it. Fantastic play. Haley counts with Actually, Haley counts on the St. Louis area leaderboard in number of assists. She's had just an absolute fantastic season for Westminster. All right, do the draw again. Again, we got Whitney Radloff on the draw. Draw straight up. Brought down by Samantha Huber. Back to Whitney Radloff. This is one of Westminster's strengths, their transition game. Back to Haley Schmer. Back to Samantha Huber. Brought over to Danny Mabry. 
behind the goal to Haley counts. We got somebody, oh, on the, Jenna Galicados was open on the far side. Didn't, couldn't get it to her. Behind the goal to Deanne File. Swung over to Jenna Galicados. Westminster dominating the play here early in the first half. Haley counts behind the goal, looking for a cutter. Nothing, swings the ball out to Samantha Huber behind the 12. Now back over to Jenna Galicados. Looking for some room. Swings it to Danny Mabry in the center. Oh, good, strong shot. Danny's been fantastic this year. She has just an absolute rocket for a left-handed shot. Again, in the leaders in St. Louis and goals. There's the ball behind the goal. Haley counts over to Danny Mabry. Danny Mabry back to Whitney Radloff. Whitney swings the ball over to Jenna Galicados. Jenna over to Danny Mabry. Danny Mabry, oh, tries to go in the middle, and there it is. Not sure what call we have here. But Danny Mabry is going to get a free position at the eight here. She has been, as I said, an absolute monster on offense. Just, she's got a great look right here. Left-handed shot on the right side of the arc. Look at that feed over there. Too. Beautiful, beautiful play. Danny Mabry with a beautiful pass to Haley Counts all alone on the side of the goal. Goal for Westminster. I think that was Haley Counts, not sure. Westminster playing an absolute beautiful control game right now. 